Communication and other gaps are identified as major challenges hampering coordination of humanitarian responses in the country. To counter this, the Minister of Humanitarian Affairs, Disaster Management and Social Development has inaugurated a National Humanitarian Coordination Technical Working Group. Now let's see what the government is up about in Moyo Thomas' reports. I hereby inaugurate the inaugurated working group is to ensure a more structured approach to the challenges of peacekeeping and humanitarian support in the Northeast. Miscommunication and mistrust are challenges that have beset humanitarian operations and has affected the relationship between the military and humanitarian organizations. At some point, the military suspended activities of some international NGOs over allegations of providing critical aid to terrorists. This allegation, the international NGOs have since dispelled. Such situations have created distrust among actors at the theater of operations who are meant to complement one another. Civil Security Cooperation, CSEC, in humanitarian intervention in the Northeast was created to find a solution to these identified challenges. It's very critical that we have uh, uh, a seamless uh, working uh, collaboration uh, between the humanitarian actors and the security uh, uh, agencies or security operators. The technical working group will provide technical support to the National Humanitarian Coordination Committee set up by President Muhammadu Buhari. The committee also met earlier to deliberate on operational constraints faced by both security and humanitarian communities. The technical working group is expected to meet once a month to address the humanitarian challenges not only in the Northeast but the whole of the country. Moya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.